Hello and welcome to episode 4 of Let's Build a Fancy House, as you can probably tell, because I am underneath Haley's tree. Okay, so, uh, last time we did this thing, and this thing, um, which so far I'm very unhappy with, kitchen maybe a bit small, or a bit big even, I don't know, I don't know. But that's not important, we're ignoring all this corridor, we're ignoring this room here today, that is being ignored, we are going to furnish and completely decorate the living room, because, yeah, I want to. Because I want to, because I want to. Okay, so first, um, I think we might need to, like, maybe do, hmm, like, at least the bottom half of the staircase might need some duty doing. So let's see what um, we can do with iron bars, see if this looks like a nice banister. I think that works quite well. Let's see if it suits on this side as well. Yeah. And it doesn't attach to the wall, which is nice because I put stairs here. I knew I put those stairs there for a reason. I'm actually quite keen on that look though. I think that might work. Obviously, I have to bring the walls up um, at some point, but yeah, I think I like that. I would love to put carpet on these stairs. Problem being, of course, I take literally any. Of carpet, I can only put carpet on every other step because otherwise I'll get that effect. And I'm not sure carpet on every other step is going to look very good. Hmm, nah, not feeling it. Oh yeah, so no carpet on the stairs. I think that's the best we can do, but I don't like saying that. I do not like saying that. Um. But like I say, the stairs aren't the main thing today, the main thing is the rest of the living room. So I just wanted to kind of get a gist of what might happen in the future for that. So first, um, I think first we'll do the little book nook area. And I've been thinking maybe for the book nook, um, bear with me on this. Does nether brick slabs pass as brown leather? I think it does. I think it does. I think... I think it does. I keep saying I think it does for a couple of seconds. I think it does, I think it does, I think it does. Yeah, I think it does. Um, now, the question is, I like that. Not just that, obviously. It's going to be a bit more to it when I'm finished. The question is, do I go for, like, a lounger? Like, you can lie on it and read your book. Do I go for a shorter version with the, uh, the very traditional... Uh, that's a bookshelf. The very traditional Minecraft chair like this also looks pretty nice. I think I'll get away with pretty much anything in this book nook, really. Um, definitely need a table. That goes without saying. Let's take a, a birch fence and our pressure plates, which are here. I've been playing so much creative lately, I swear I don't know where everything is in the... Uh, survival, sorry. I don't know where it's in the creative menus. Getting silly now. Um, with or without? With or without? With, without, with, without, with or without? That's the question. I don't know, with or without? <laughs> um, without. I think without. I might, I might change my mind. More than likely will change my mind. But for now, I'm going without. I think we can probably get away with a little bit of a rug in here as well. So let's go for dark green and brown. That feels a bit more cozy to me. It's not too bright. Let's go for a simple checkered rug here. And there's a book nook. Can we go for a full... Maybe, actually, here's the thing. All right, so if it's brown leather, then it'll obviously be reasonably cozy. So it makes sense to do this. Yeah. And then you can, uh, you can, like, lounge on it a little bit more. Yeah, I like that. That's nice. Okay. So, sticking with the brown weather theme, we are going to go and make our big couches. And uh, I think one big couch and one big chair is probably going to be the best bet. 
I wish I could put some stuff on these shelves. I keep seeing these shelves. I wish I could, like, put stuff on them, but they are occupying the block above them, and they, there's no way of putting stuff on top of um, things. Anyway, I mean, maybe there is if they were on the top block. Let's have an experiment. Experimenting with drag. Right. Uh, if I put that there, I'm pretty sure I can't put a plant pot on top of that now. If I can, I'll be pleased, but I'm pretty sure it's not the case. I know I'll have to crouch, obviously, to do it. I need some random blocks to stand on. Oh, yeah, here we go. Let's have a look. No, didn't think so. No plant pot on that. So, yeah. Can't put anything on shelves of this style, but they look nice anyway. Um... So I'm going to keep them, I do like them, at least I'm going to keep them for now, everything's subject to change, that is the quote of the day, okay, so let's make some chairs and such, so we need nether brick slabs and nether brick, make them very basic and then kind of munch into it and see if we can make it look a little tastier, so there's a really basic version of what we are doing, I can tell already it's a little bit... Why am I destroying everything? I just need to move the whole thing along one. Do, 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 like so. Okay, so we got like our couches. And we need to make these look less rubbish. So first things first, I think we can probably do some experimenting with the stairs. Might make him, things look a little less weird. Try this, maybe. See, that's already a thousand times better. I like that now. Okay, let's do that with this as well. Do, 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 do. Here we go. Yeah, like I say, already a thousand times better. But I want to kind of cushion, I think, maybe, this might not work, but I want to kind of cushion these tops. So I think if I take some... We only have like one shade of brown wool, and I don't think it's going to suit this. Let's have a look. No, that is horrible. Horrible, horrible, horrible. I think that's pretty much... Maybe the green? Bear with me on this. Uh, the orange. Okay, I'm going to try the orange first. <laughs> yeah, the orange doesn't work at all. Um... Maybe the green. No. No, no, no. Maybe, maybe just at the back? No. No, doesn't work. I think that is our seating. We can probably make them a little bit flusher with, like, can we get away with bringing it up one like that? No, that's ridiculous. It looks very untidy. Put that stir back. Like the stir, there it is. Like a show. Okay, we're halfway through the video already. We've got three chairs. Good progress is being made here. All right, I just, I still think that it just needs to be just a little bit more. Just a little bit more. A little bit pressure plates. Maybe pressure plates. Maybe gold pressure plates. <laughs> Alright, I'm just being stupid now. Obviously not gold pressure plates. That is ridiculous. Maybe wooden pressure plates. I know this isn't going to work. I'm just cycling through the options. And you never know. I might come to one that looks kind of nice. I also saw something that I liked to look on a second ago. So I'm going to relook at that. That's awful. Alright. Um, bear with me on this. Look. Um, I really like that. Yeah, I do. I really, um, comments if you think that's awful, but I think that is a little bit different. I think it kind of works. Yeah. All right. So now what we want is we want a little table, like a little coffee table in the middle. Um, our options are relatively limited. We could, of course, go with a wood. 
The annoying thing about wood on wood is also is always the fact that obviously it really does blend. Um, not that that looks bad. I think that looks actually kind of alright, but not perfect. I really would like perfect. We could go with the quartz slabs, always a strong one for a coffee table, but there's a lot of dark colours in this living room, and that is kind of shockingly bright compared to them. So I'm not entirely sure about that. Maybe sandstone. Maybe. Oh, that is not the sandstone. This is the sandstone. I think that's going to be our best bet, really. When it comes down to it, I mean, none of the other stones, that's for sure. Uh, probably not the bricks. I'd be very surprised if no, not the bricks at all. Um, maybe the acacia, no, not the acacia wood, the walls and that acacia. Pretty much none of the wooden slabs would work. They, apart from possibly the dark, because of how dark they are. We use dark for anything else, just the doors. And right above the table. No, that's not going to work. Yeah, I think, um, you know, I'm re reasonably happy with the sandstone anyway, so I think we're going to go with the sandstone for our coffee table. It looks all right. Now, this area, this area, this area. I'd love to do a grand piano, but I've never seen a grand piano that works in Minecraft, so I'm not going to join the uh, bad grand pianos club. Uh, we've got this area to fill as well. Really a lot of space empty. <clears throat> so I think um, in this area or this area, one of these two is a little dining area. If we don't have an actual dining room um, or plans for a dining room in this house, I think the dining room can go in the living room. Um, yeah, yeah, the dining room can go in the living room. So if the dining room is going in the living room, then that is what I'm going to do next. Here we go. Right. So, dining room table. This, I'm fairly confident that we can use wood. Um, we just have to make it look beautiful. Beautiful is important. So, let's use... What have we got? Look, spruce wood. I think that's what the floor is made of. Yep. We have got... Obviously, we've got our super dark oak. The question of how thick we want this to be as well, like, that is obviously way too broad. Like, that's taking a lot of space up, so definitely less than three, so we're talking about at least as small as two. Hmm. Let's take some logs, dark oak logs. Put them like this, and maybe we want a dining table to be... Oh, in front of the window! Oh, yeah! Yes, 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 in front of the window would be nice. Stick our chairs in here. We could stick like a... What did I want to do? I wanted to do something with this. Oh, yeah. Um, It was... What did I want to do with this? I wanted to do... Yeah. So take our sandstone, put it there, take a cosy looking bit of carpet, uh, let's go with the green, yeah the green, uh, it's just a bit of um, a bit of window sleeping to sit on and I hate it, <laughs> I'm not a fan of doing interiors people, I'm not, I'm hoping you're all bearing with me on this, I will get better though. I want to get, once I get better at it, I just, um, I don't enjoy it much at the moment. When you get better at something, you do start to enjoy it more. One, two, three, maybe, oh dear, I'm breaking the floor, I'm breaking the floor. <clears throat> maybe, here. Space the chairs there, space the chairs there. Get out of there, okay. Let's, uh... Stick some chairs in before we run out of time. Uh, we shall go with the sandstone for the stairs, maybe uh, for the chairs even. Just have four of them, like this. Four? Well, not the sandstone, not that close to the 
the Stanstone Surround, Stanstone, no, not called Stanstone, let's have some Birchwood chairs. We have four or two. We probably want four, really, because this is supposed to be a family home, and two chairs at the dining room table does not say family home. So let's have four. And for this, we are going to use, for two reasons, one, because it's a little different, and two, because of the way they sit. We'll use item frames for the arms of these chairs. Like I say, because they look a little bit different and because I can put, it means I can put the chairs nice and close together because two item frames are happy to occupy the same block. So, let's stick them in there. Let me shut this door. It's getting drafty. It's <laughs> getting drafty. There's a hole in the ceiling. Right, anyway. Um, yeah, dining room, dining room area thing. Funky looking table though, I quite like that design. Different. Yeah. Um, something for the table. Let's have a plant on the table. A fern in it. Like so. Um, ba -ba -da -ba -da -ba -da -ba -da -ba right. This, dress this window area. So I think what we need is we need like a, a windowsill. So we're probably going to go for shelved windowsill using the books like this. Okay, this is what I was talking about earlier where we can put a carpet in it and it's like an, a thing you can sit on as well as, you know, it's actually something you can park your booty on. Or we can have the middle bit something you can park your booty on and the side bit can have a couple of laptops on it. Might work a little better. Uh, let's have a geometry sapling and a oak sapling. I would use the flowers, but in this texture pack they're just single flowers. And they look a bit weird in plant pots, like if we have vases, that makes sense, but... Oh, it's just a bit strange. I might make my piece of it eventually. In, um, in the fantasy texture pack, the yellow flowers actually look more like a bunch of flowers. They look a little bit better. Uh, but we're not on the fantasy texture pack, so who gives a poop? Right. Bam, there we go. Bit symmetrical. Uh, yeah, yeah, okay. We can go with that. We can do it. It looks alright. Right, um, this area here could do with a bit of a rug. Let's go with grey and black. Grey and black rug here. The nickel one. Fill the space. Um, put that back and just go with black here, black here. Then we want a rug that surrounds this. Um, we haven't got a lot of options for colours for rugs because I don't want to go bright. Like if I go, that's oh, probably yellow and orange rug. It's going to look stupid. Maybe not. I don't know. Let's try it. Let's try it. I'm probably going to hate this. Yeah, let's try it. Let's keep the orange. Let's keep the orange. Get rid of the yellow and try orange and purple. Am I being ridiculous now? Is this just too. <laughs> I don't know. No. There's just something very awful about that. Let's go. I like the orange. I'm actually I'm convinced with the orange. So let's go orange and either white or green. Let's try white and green. So white, green. Try the white, is it a bit glary, a bit too bright? It could work. Try the green, I'm probably going to like the green more though, to be honest. And the answer is, yes, I do like the green more, that's a nice carpet. Right, we've got a rug, got a table, chairs, dining room, blah, 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 blah. Um, definitely need to do a lot more with those stairs, I think. We got this area here. Now, what we could do to flush this area out a bit is have more bookshelves. Um, I'm not against more bookshelves. But I feel like I'm cheating a bit using so many of them. Like I'm just starting to get to the point where I'm just using them as filler now. Um, so I don't know. Let me know if you have an opinion on that. Do let me know in the description. Oh dear, a bit. Of Damp going on there. Right, let's try it this way. 
Oh, I did it again. All right, let's throw this into the fire so I'm not tempted to use it again. Okay, da, 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 da. and then we have another area where we can sit and relax there with our books. These people like books. Nothing wrong with that, that's for damn sure. These people do like their books. Okay, it's filling up nicely, I think, this living room. Um, I get a thing with builds where, like, everything's awful for a really long time while I'm building it, and then it'll just suddenly come together, and this living room is giving me hope now, I will say that. Especially considering we are building on the Xbox. We don't have meta blocks. We don't have a, a lot of fancy texture packs. We don't have the ability to change our uh, our biomes in the middle of a block to change the styles of things. We only have like plant parts, a couple of skulls, and a couple of plants to put on like shelves and stuff. There's not a whole lot of options compared to some PC builds. But still, I mean, I hope you agree with me. This proves that. You can still make something pretty with it. And I like it. So, let's see. We are just about ready to finish. But I want to do one last little touch. I've just noticed something. I want to give it a go. What if I go like this here? Yep, yeah, like it. Okay. Anyway, that is... We are actually running a little bit late on this. Clearly I'm enjoying myself. But, uh, yeah, that's a good start to the interior decoration I will say but for now we go and relax back under Haley Street and uh, we say as usual, thank you for joining me on this adventure and I do hope you join me next time bye